Amazing, Laura. Even when I foresee your movements, you counter me instantly. I couldn't do it without Hazel's power. What about you? I don't see you using Mithra's hidden ability. And what if we did? Well, if you did... I just have to bring out my original blade. Master Adam. Your evening meal is ready for you. Oh, is it that time already? The days are so long at this time of year. I just start losing track. Oh, finished already? That's a shame. I was hoping to join in. Join in? By yourself? His Majesty has many pressing matters to attend to. Besides, I'm used to working alone. A driver and blade are one in body and soul. That's their very nature. You're not at full strength without him. It's not so simple as all that. I know I've yet to unlock the depths of your power. Really? I feel like I've been giving it my all. But you never stop growing. At any rate, Hayes' ability to restrict other blades is indispensable. It's perfect for training. We're lucky. When she stops me using my foresight, it's certainly difficult. Oh, but you honor me too much. I'm just happy to help you both in any way I can. Next to each other like that, you really do look like twins, you two. It's rare for the driver's nature to appear so strongly in their blade. People tell me that from time to time, but is it really true? Perhaps. But whatever the reason, I am happy if I look even a little like you, my lady. We're even the same dress size. Right? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, we want to try taking you on next, Jin. Well, how about it, Jin? I'm afraid I don't particularly like fighting. And to think we're hearing that from the strongest man in Torna. But perhaps there's truth in those words. After all, he, or rather, they, My lord, my lady, we've discovered Malos's target. The capital. What? Are you sure? Yes, no doubt about it. <laughs>